Hello everyone and welcome to today's special series called The Adventures of the Cow Hunter. I am your host Adam Petway, residential cow hunter extraordinaire and we are going to go on an adventure. So I'm taking you guys with me, let's go. Now, we are off in search of the elusive humped back bull. Very elusive, very volatile. You have to be careful when approaching this bull. But I, the cow hunter, am willing to risk it all for you guys so you can see this majestic animal in his natural habitat. Thought I heard something, but that's okay. We will have to trek through the most dangerous terrain Mother Nature has ever brought us. The highest mountains, the lowest valleys. Basically my backyard. My backyard. Now. <coughs> oh God, now. Let's find him. Now I shall have you guys know that I am a exceptional tracker of the humpback bull. He will be very hard, very, very hard to find. But it seems that we have made a discovery. What is this? Oh my, it seems to be a cow pie, or scientifically known as cow poop. Now normally, oh god, zoomed in too much. Now normally, you know the crocodile hunter would stick his hand in the poop to check its freshness, but not the cow hunter. He does not do that. But I am off and I am still tracking him. So let us continue our tracking. It seems we have made another astounding discovery. We are in this metal cage. Metal, you see. This must be where they kept the dangerous beasts as they were teleporting him here. Now, as I told you before, the humpback bull is dangerous. Very, very dangerous. So, we must keep quiet. We must stay low. The humpback cow hates when people stand up. He also hates when you wear your sombrero the wrong way. Like this. Eh, can you see? Yes. No. Don't do it. If sea bears really exist, why didn't one show up? Maybe it's because you're not wearing your sombrero in a goofy fashion. Oh, pff, sorry. How silly of me. You mean like this? <laughs> no, like that. If you learned anything from Spongebob Squarepants on that episode where Squidward went camping, don't wear your sombrero in a funny way. Oh God, I almost fell. Now, let's continue to track him. I feel we are getting very, very close. Just stay with me for a couple more minutes. Uh, uh, hello. Right now, the humpback bull seems like it's a couple meters away. And I'm on the ground to be suspicious. I can't let him find me. Now, if you must know, I just slayed in an ant bed, so I am getting bit by these ants. So, hold on one second. <sighs> okay. I'm back. The ants almost took me out. They didn't want me to succeed, but I did. I did, I succeeded. So now let us, let's run. We must stay low and stay elusive. Yeah. Yeah. If, let me come back to myself. Uh, 
if the ball were to find us, he would probably stomp me to death. I would suggest that no one tries this at home. Like I said before, the humpback bull, scientific name, Humpacus bullocus, is a very angry, angry animal. You must be cautious when approaching him. Like I said, no one try this at home. Seems we are getting quite close to the herd where the humped back bull may be found. It seems like I have caught the attention of a voracious horse. I shall let you see if I can zoom in enough. Look at it over there, grazing over by the water hole. He is testing me to see if I will cross it I don't know if I can but for you guys the cow hunter is willing to do whatever it takes pray for me as I attempt to cross this dangerous dangerous terrain I have my stick too just in case Ish gets crazy and I have to run away as you can see, we have some swampy terrain around here. Maybe some crocodiles and alligators would be here. Oh my god. I don't know if you just saw this, but that horse just took off. He must know that we are in search for that elusive humped back bull. Now, as you can see on the ground, these are the footprints of the king of the field the humped back bull. Now, I must warn you, I don't know what you are about to see, but if you are squeamish, I will tell you to turn away. The life amidst the young humped back bull is not an easy one. There are many predators out there that would try and take him out. As you can see on the ground below, I am about to pick this up. This is the bones of one of the humpback bulls. He was feasted upon by a cheetah. Let me show you. This is the burial ground for the humpback bull. This one put up quite a fight, but was no match. But hopefully we can catch him in his natural habitat. I feel as though we are close, closer than we've ever been before. I thank you for staying tuned. We are on a roll. Seems as though we have ended up in another swampery is that a snake? No, no, it's just a stick. Okay. I feel we are getting close to the herd. Hopefully an endaconda does not jump out of this water and attack me. As you can see, the three horses are still there, but we are close. We are coming very close to this cow. The humpback bull. I don't know if you can see his gray hump majestically flopping between those trees. We should get a closer look. It seems as if we are very close. The cows are standing up. Oh, as you can see, we have a good view of the herd. Let me see if I can focus this. And as you can see, their leader, the humpback cow, is staring me in the eyes. Hopefully, I can approach. I need to approach slowly as to not to offend the beast. As I said before, he is very, very angry. We do not want 
don't rate him anymore. As I said before, what I am doing is extremely dangerous. At any point in time, this bull and these cows could turn on me and stomp my lights out like I was from New York getting stomped by some Timberlands. But I'm risking it all for you guys. I'm getting quite close. Let me turn around so you can see. See these majestic creatures in their natural habitat. Let me focus. Yes. 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 We are quite close to them. Beautiful, isn't it? As you can see, the humped back cow stands above them all with his hump, majestically humpy. Look, as he runs and gallops like an angel of the field, it seems like his running has stirred the other cows and they are running for their lives. What are they afraid of? I do not wait. Oh, my camera fell. What they are afraid of, I do not know. They are seen, they are, cows are told to be very skish. But the humpback bull has gone off on his own. He does not fear me and my presence. We are outside. My shoulders hurt very bad from holding this camera up. I just got done working out the other day, doing shoulders. Where is he, the humpback cow is there. Like I said before, scientifically known, as Humpacus Bullocus. This humpback bull is not to be trifled with. I think we have gotten as close as we can get to the mighty beast. Today has been a wonderful day for science. We. <coughs> oh God. <coughs> oh God. <coughs> Today. <coughs> It's been an incredible day. I am Adam Petway, residential cow hunter extraordinaire. And I would like to thank you all for viewing this. Stay tuned. There will be more coming soon. Peace.